Thank you so much. That's Trollen Garna, sponsored by the Vasa Order of America. Now, um, I just don't know. You know, something has gone terribly wrong, and the program is on schedule. Uh, this is a this is a present. You know, we've we this happened last year too. Once. And I, I, I just hate to set this kind of a precedent, but uh, that's, as my brother used to say, that's the way the Mercedes bends, and there's nothing we can do about it. And in about, in about 10 minutes, Guy Evans is going to show up with a bass player and play you some blues on the harmonica. And I haven't seen Guy yet, but I know he's going to be here then as he's not scheduled until 3 o'clock. So once again, we're going to have a short break, let the sound system cool down, even though the shade is here, while the perspiration is still rolling off of me just like sweat, and it's a little bit warm. There's food, there's drinks. Uh, there is a remarkable artist over on that side of the park, Mr. Ernesto Delgadillo, who creates piñatas, Beautiful piñatas out of things that most of us throw away. Newspapers, cardboard rolls from the insides of toilet paper rolls and paper towel rolls, old boxes, glue made out of flour and water, bits of colored paper. And out of these, he creates remarkable works of art. And he is over there with piñatas in all stages of construction. He has a little handout. He doesn't speak a lot of English. His wife speaks some English, and if you wish to communicate with him, I think if you work on it, you can. We're trying to find a bilingual person to sit in the booth and help him. And until then, you might really find yourself rewarded for visiting Mr. Delgadillo, because he is an artist. He's, he does beautiful things. And we'll see you up here in about 10 minutes. Hope you all having as good a time as I am, because I'm having a ball. And I'll see you in about 10 minutes. Tucson isn't what you necessarily think of as blues country. But Tucson isn't necessarily what you think of as Middle Eastern Oud country or Chinese Huchin country either. Tucson, however, is a place where folks have come from all over the United States and to see why. And they've brought a lot of exciting skills, abilities, knowledge with them. And one person who moved into Tucson a few years ago is a man from Baltimore. Now, Baltimore isn't blues country either, but Guy Evans was in the army in Texas, in central Texas, and that neighbor's is blues country. And he picked up the start of playing blues harp, blues harmonica, when he was in Texas. He's been keeping with it ever since. He's got a bass player with him this year named Philip Davis. I said bass player. I didn't even look at his instrument. That's a guitar. That isn't a bass. Good grief. <laughs> I, guy told me, I think Guy said he was going to bring a bass player with me, so he, so he fooled me. <laughs> yeah. All righty. Philip Davis and Guy Evans. A little bit of blues. I'm going to do um, two tunes to start out with. I'm going to do one of my own called Revenge Blues, and then I'm going to do a very old gospel blues tune called um, Swing Low Sweet Chariot. So hold on a few minutes. <laughs> treat me so mean if you love me baby why you want to treat me so mean this is all a nightmare and the wish it become just a dream it's so hard to fail flat on my face split me up all over the plate i tell you what i'm gonna do be a kick by an ass or two
said, you didn't even leave me a thing. You took all I had, said, you didn't even leave me a thing. Use me, I love you now, some mother, the joke is your king. It was hard, it fell flat on my face. Split me up all over the plate. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. Be a kick by an ass or two. Thank you.